looking like uh, Salem has been uh, disqualified. Mm. Focusing on uh, their health. Three, mm. two, one, Always important. Go! Absolutely. And so, but... speak of the devil, we've got Beast versus Jazar. Yeah, we got Lyric on stream. Mm. It sure looks that way. And um, Jazar actually getting a bit of a um, bit of a music buff here with the Dr. Mario theme playing on Smattlefield for game one. So why are you but calling it Smattlefield? Because it's small battlefield. And I like Portman. Call it small battlefield. Don't call it Smattlefield. Um, how many syllables is small battlefield? Four. How many syllables is Smattlefield? Three. I think yeah, I read that. But which one doesn't sound disgusting? You think that matters for me? I matter it. There's so much action, we have to save every syllable we can, Drex. So, I mean, so, okay. We gotta talk about the Beast Zard. Um, that is, I'm, I'm pretty sure that is literally his Twitter handle, but this man loves Charizard. Play. Um, he just has no a love extent. affair with this character. I'm surprised that second play blitz was not punished, but in the end, mm. this is still able to get that stop. And keeping it even here, which, I mean, this is, um, like, this is a pretty, this has, like, very, very big implications on the matchup here. And this is a huge match that, where you want to really assert yourself. Okay. This is, uh, this is the beast experience there, charging that down smash with your opponent, like, you know, half a stage length away. Oh, the and just smash. getting that up getting smash. That yep. Really getting his money's worth out of that A button. I think that's one of Beast's like biggest uh, benefits, like how good he is at just calling out someone's options. Mm, it's just yeah. incredible. And Charizard, like, it's like Pokemon Trainer is such a good tournament for it. Uh, or, uh, it's a tournament, such a good character for it because he can play exactly how he wants to on Zard, but he still has the safety valves of Squirtle and uh, Ivysaur if that style doesn't appear to be working out. Because this is also somebody who was a very, very accomplished fox in uh, in Smash 4, in this game as well, but also in Smash 4. Oh, no Joel, you're from Pennsylvania. You gotta hit those. You gotta hit those. You're giving us all a bad name. You're saying every single person in Pennsylvania could have tech that? I'm saying it's not called Techsylvania for no reason, okay? Anyway. What if you're from Texas? Well, that's with an X, obviously. Oh, okay, my mistake. So going for the back throw, back air to get a really early stock to really close out this game, but not finding it, not swinging too early with the back air. Um, recognizing the power that Doc has here in this uh, in this last stock situation. But uh, Beast is. I, I don't think we're going to see another Pokemon for the rest of this game. I think we're getting. This is going so. to be Ride or Die Charizard. My, my man will is... solo this Charizard whenever he gets mm. a chance. Yeah. Like, I think he is one of the few people on the face of the planet that was actually upset that, like, he can't just solo the, <laughs> the entire time. I mean, he's trying as best he can, and he's making it work with that back air. Uh, that is Bees taking game one. Over, it's always uh, funny to me. It's always funny yeah. to me when you uh, when you hear someone say Charizard is the worst Pokemon. And, like, in, in hindsight, while that could be the case, it's not like it's bad. Charizard mm. is not a bad character. And if you think otherwise, you really need to evaluate how you're looking at this game. Like, like if you... Like, you can say Charizard might be the worst of the three Pokemon, and yes. Beast will look at you in... Like, look at you in your eyes and say to your face, all right, bet. And then he will do to you what he just did to Jazar, which is, you know, use those smash attacks, which are, like, deceptively, de deceptively quick and deceptively, like... They have, they have a lot of deceptive range to them. Like, use the tail pokes, use that insanely strong back air, and use that flare. Like, he will just throw everything and the kitchen sink at you. He will literally tell you, if you truly think this is correct, then 1v1 me right now. You can use every Pokemon. I'll stick mm -hmm. solo hard. Absolutely. Are we seeing a Lucas coming out right now? Is that what we, I just saw? I think we are. And 
I, based on how this tournament has gone for Jazar, this makes sense because game one loss with Doc to Blue Striker into two consecutive wins with Lucas over Blue Striker to make it into top 16. This is, uh, this is a switch that he has done already once to make it to this point in this tournament. Well, let's hope that this character switch is actually going to benefit him in this case right now. Because, mm. uh, because again, this is this is probably one of the best trainers that we've seen in the Wi-Fi scene for a long time right now. Absolutely. But again, okay, okay. I also need to talk about though. It's Lucas, dude, and I don't think there's ever been a more underrated character in this game. Like, tell me about and, uh, it. Listen. MDVA was right. Ban Lucas, bro. What is this character? <laughs> like, I'm saying that. MDVA was right. This character is jank, bro. Like, this character is so fast, it seems like every single move leads into every other move in their entire arsenal. And it's just so powerful. You know what else? It's not even MDVA. We've been watching WebJP for months in this region. And we've been, like, WebJP has torn a path of destruction with Lucas through this region. Um, so, I mean, but that, that also, it needs to be said, Beast is another player who's been out here grinding with these Wi-Fi tournaments. So they have experience on really, really strong Lucas competition. So there's not going, there shouldn't be a hint of matchup inexperience here for Joel. No, I don't think there should be at all, but like, yeah. even though matchup experience is highly important in any matchup Lucas might just not care. Game, yeah, exactly. Like, it's, it's yeah. Lucas, dude. This character yeah. may just negate everything. He's, I mean, he's just zoopity doo dah like, around your, around your character's shield. He's got those low aerials. He's got so many tricky follow-ups out of so many of his, like, his low aerials, his grab aerial. This is a character that you really need to be aware of and scared of. Um, and you also really need to like hit with that forward air. Beast oh getting that first stock off the board, but taking like, a lot of damage in the process. You, I need you to tell me right now, why does down tilt confirm into F smash? I the kid's why mother's dead. He needs the... something, okay? Whoa! Spoilers, bro. Spoilers. 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 I mean, spoilers for what? Yes. Maybe if you can read Japanese. These English were wrongs. <laughs> anyway. Um, I will, whenever I look at Lucas, all I can think about is that E3. I believe it was 2014 with the adult chicken claymation. Yes. Like the, come on, Reggie, give us Mother 3. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> sets the dude on fire. <laughs> yes, he does. That was, that was a really good, that was a really good bit. Um... But a really good, uh, a really good game here from Jazar in game two, looking like a completely different matchup, and really forcing a lot of ants, like forcing Beast to really think of the answers. And his answer was that the is answer. To, yeah, was that the answer? Yeah, was that the response? Was that the response? Dude, I'm telling you, man, this character is something else. Like this character, you just don't know what to do. Because for any other character, because this Lucas, this Lucas looks strong. This Lucas looks like I don't know how leveling works in 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 Mother Three, Earthbound Two, whatever. But uh, I'm just gonna go out on a limb saying this is a level 99 Lucas. And is it, is it music Earthbound Two? I don't I don't know I don't know. Because, how isn't it because because no because Mother One is Earthbound Beginnings, Mother Two is Earthbound One, and then Mother Three is Mother Three. Oh, so going for oh, oh, just a weird. bit missed time there. That's not Ness. That's not like it, the timing is different. Oh yeah, yeah going... that, that's there, dude. I forgot about that there. And Beast was going for a bit of an ed, like an early Enzo edge guard there with the um, with the drag down there from I Ivysaur, but uh, the percents weren't quite there to connect into the up B off stage. Oh, and oh, you can't jump oh, into that. You saw him do that man. three times last game. You can't, you can't just, you, you can't, can't jump do up that, there. bro. You can't do it. And that's like, that is a stock that you, you really can't afford to give away when you're fighting against Beast. You can't throw any stock away against Beast. No, no, absolutely not. And Beast has to be looking for a lot of extra credit here. 
Oh, that headbutt. It's not much, but it is something. And this is what this is what uh, Jazar needs to do. That PK fire and the PK ice and the Zer just keep Beast at a distance. He doesn't need to commit to close options. He can just keep him at a distance for as long as he wants, and Beast is just gonna have to accept it and play that game. And okay, so he he, he got uh, Ivy Ivy score tanked as many hits as uh, as it could, and now we're back into the the, the sweeper. Um, he, uh, I, Char Charizard ha got the dragon dances off, and it it's ready to rumble here. Oh my god, dude. That, that what a mash. Just turns into so much. What a mash, though. And another high side B. Yeah, oh, great seems, oh my god. Great timing that, on the getup into the parry up smash. The high side B does seem to be Beast's like go to option whenever something like that happens. Oh my god. And so he and so he says, How about a low side B? I got them all for you. Yeah. He, he was just like, You wanna keep talking, bro? You wanna keep talking? Yeah. He's got the stream up right now. And he's, there's the response. We're technically okay. coaching him. We're technically oh, yeah. coaching him right now, bro. I don't know, he can't be coached. Because I mean he can't be coached because how do you know what goes on in his head? No. They're, they're like, no one knows what happens in yeah. that man's head, bro. My man's oh, but he, so hard. Oh! Doesn't go for the double, but now he's got him. Oh, that's it. Yeah. That's gotta be Great. it. No, but it is Lucas. Great. Oh, but it's not Lucas. Great oh play. Gosh. Great, great play. I'm, okay. I'm actually shocked that, uh, that he couldn't make it back. Lucas is one of those characters, it seems like, if they get their angle right, they make it back from anywhere, but wow. Um... A low-ish percent deep dare from Ivysaur is what takes